Hey, what's up YouTube? Today I will be making another Weeby.net tutorial and today I will be showing you guys how to format date and time in Visual Basic 2010. Alright, so first of all you have to add one label and five buttons to your form and five timers to your form and the timer one is associated with the button one similarly the button two is associated with timer two button three button four and button five they all associated with their timers all right so i will run through the codes quickly go on your time now coding and then for as i told you before button one is linked to timer one in the button 1 you just type in all the timer 2 dot enable equals false till timer 5 dot enable equals false except the timer 1 you make it true okay then you go back to your form 1 design and then you click on timer 1 and in timer 1 you type in label 1 dot text equals time of day so the label 1 is this it will show the current time of day and then you click on convert to 12 hour format uh, and that's a button 2 and then it disable all other timers except the timer 2 and then go back to your timer 1 timer 2 coding and in here you see um, the label 1.txt equals format time of day and in the comma in quotations you type in H M M S S T T and then close your quotations and your parentheses and then you go back to your form one design date now this is button three you disable all the timers except the timer three go back to your timer three and this one here label one dot text equal date time dot now dot date this gives you the current date of the year and then you go back to you change you format the date from the date time dot now dot date to mmddyy it shows the month first and then the date and then the year and as you can see in the timer three uh, in the timer four it shows you Label one dot text equals format date time dot now dot day m m d d y y. All right, so come back to your button five, which is the last button, and it's associated with the timer five. So do click your button five. You disable all the timers except the the timer five, and then go back to your form one design and choose timer five and then as you can see it formats to date first then the month and then the full year like 2010 in the other one which i showed you before was this one it just formatted to like 0810 so i'll quickly run the program show you guys how it looks like all right so you click on your date now button and it shows you the current date you format it to mmddyy format see how it's abbreviates the 2010 to make it 10 and you can go back to your ddmmyy which is the full date and then you click on your time now shows you the current time and then you go convert to 12 hour format it's convert to 12 hour format now so thanks guys for watching this video Please rate, comment and subscribe and there will be a link in the description for you guys to copy codes from the from the website. So yeah, check it out and yeah, subscribe please. Thank you.